spread between Cha Eun Woo and Kim Se Jong. When we look at Cha Eun Woo, I think he's somebody who wants to do a lot in life. He is very, um, I think he's very multi-talented and he has a lot of interest. So he's good at many things. Again, a very multi-talented kind of guy. Uh, he doesn't seem to be ready to settle down or commit. He's not in that stage of his life where he wants to commit with just one person. He is in the stage of life where I really want to be successful. I want to be achieving a lot of things in my life. And, you know, I want to get all those things. He is in that stage of his life. She is the Knight of Wands, which uh, is, you know, someone who's very passionate and who's there for her friend. She's somebody who will, you know, be a strong support. Somehow I feel when I look at that wand is that, you know, she's somebody who is ready to support you. And I think the relationship between them is, you know, very good friendship where they support each other. When here we have the four of swords between both of them and we have somebody resting with you know their hands in a prayer position we also have a lady and a child over here so i have this again feeling between both of them is that there is a lot of support they are comfortable with each other to such an extent that they can rest so when they are in each other's company they don't have to pretend they don't have to be somebody else they can be who they are and I think it is, it's like a relationship where, you know, you're like in the middle of the night, I am so anxious, I need help. She'll be able to call him and get that help and vice versa. He'll also be able to call her and say, you know what, I need this immediately. Just get it for me or, you know, come and do this for me. He is, their, their friendship is that kind. There is rest and comfort between both of them. Obviously, there is some criticism uh, going on. I think they are... You know, when somebody is too comfortable with you, they just tell you anything they want to tell you. There is no uh, lock on the uh, mouth, on the tongue, and they end up telling each other things also, which usually you will not tell. They are really good friends. He will be able to criticize her constructively so that she becomes better what she is, and vice versa. She'll be able to tell him, like, look, you're being too much over here, and get your act together. They have that kind of comfort level between both of them. They can be honest with each other. They don't have to worry that, okay, you know, that person will never talk to me again just because I said this. That is the level of friendship which I see over here between them. The challenges between them. <clears throat> we are the king of cups. So there must be somebody. Either this shows a person who is very emotional and maybe somebody she is interested in or uh, maybe it could be a father figure there's somebody uh, in her life who doesn't like maybe their friendship doesn't like the fact that they're so close it could be anybody but even though i find the king of cups a very emotional stable person is not a it's an experienced person it's an older person so most probably it is just somebody who maybe doesn't like how close these two are but other than that, I really don't see much of challenges, actually. Outcome, the higher of end, very traditional. So I think they are friends, a very traditional relationship of being friends, you know. The kind who, um, so I don't see any major problem happening over here, nor do I see actually a major obstacle. They're just good friends. Let me see his feelings for her. Let me see. What is Chao? Who feel for Kim's Chao? What are his feelings towards her? Ten of Cups. King of Swords. Okay. So he finds her like, you know, beautiful. She, she is the embodiment of everything actually he wants a woman to be. The Nine of Pentacles over here. The King of Swords. And we have the Ten of Cups. So it's something like, you know, he actually can be uh, happily in a relationship with her if he chooses to. It's just that right now he's not in that state where he wants to settle down. But when he's with her, he's truly happy. And, you know, and he is uh, attracted to her also in the sense he finds her, you know, really charming, really beautiful. But he also, we also have a king of sword energy where he knows uh, 
she's not going to let him off easily you know if he makes a mistake he's also very truthful very honest and he finds her also very truthful and honest towards him that is what he likes you know so they actually are very compatible i would say that they're actually very compatible even if they wanted to go ahead and have a relationship they would be compatible it's just that they're not in that situation in life right now what are her feelings for him wow these cards just flew off we have two of wands we have justice and we have anger so maybe initially she may have liked him but i don't think uh that relationship ever worked out and whenever i see any card for her i know she is going through some sort of heartbreak she's had a tough life and she's gone through a lot of uh you know heartbreak and difficult times in life when you have justice and you have two of wands so i don't see any feelings for him right now in her you know even though she sees him as a good person she sees him as he's truthful he's just he's somebody she can trust uh she is not you know she's not emotionally involved or initially she may have been attracted to him but now it's not there anymore let me put it that way yeah. something could have happened between them earlier but i don't think it ever grew to you know a full fledged romantic relationship they just became friends and then they have decided to remain as friends because that equation works for them better than anything else that is what i feel it is so let me summarize that i find them very good friends you know the friends who you can depend on and the friends who will have the guts to criticize you and tell you when you're doing something wrong so that is what i feel the conclusion is and uh, i hope you'll enjoyed this reading if you all did please give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and have a good day bye bye